Hi guys, I hope you're doing well. Um, this is going to be kind of a collective project pan with all the items that I have yet to finish from my previous projects. And um, I would just want to apologize right now if I sound a little funny. I am kind of sick right now. I am filming in my PJs because I just wanted to be comfy, but I still wanted to film for you guys today. So yeah, I'm just going to quickly show you all the items and where I'm starting at. Um, or at least where I left off from the other projects, and then I will update you monthly. I'm not going to put a timeline on it just yet, because honestly, some of these items are probably going to take me quite a while. I kind of want to judge how quickly I'm using, or how quickly I'm able to go through them before I go and set a unrealistic timeline, because I don't want to stress about it. I just want it to be something that motivates me to use these items a little bit more. Um, so yeah, we'll just get right into it. This is my Mary Kay, like, well, basically it's a trio. This is a little customizable um, palette, but um, what I have left are these three shadows. This one I have hit pan in. These two I have a little bit of a dip in. Um, I just, these take forever to go through. It's ridiculous. Um, they are so pigmented. They're very shimmery, so a little goes a long way, and uh, I'll just be happy when they're gone. Another item that's going to take me quite a while is my CoverGirl 225 Charm Lipstick. Um, still quite a lot left. Um, I marked it on the cap there, so that lower one is where I'm at right now. And um, it's just a pretty kind of deep red, um, brownie red. It's just, I'm not much of a lipstick person, especially not at work. Um, so it's going to take me a while, but I am making a effort to use it every day and I have been and um, it is showing a little bit obviously but it's just going to take me a while. Then I've got my Avon lip balm. Um, I think what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to take off this little plastic wrap so that you can actually see the clear plastic um, tube inside and see like how much is left in there because basically what I've just been doing is when I roll it down I'm marking where I'm at um, but it's a little deceiving because it doesn't go right down all the way. So that way you can kind of get a better idea of how much I have left for that. But yeah, just a lip balm. It'll be super easy to use. I've been using it all throughout the day. Um, it's just a lot of times I'm busy and I forget to reapply. Um, and then I've got my Sephora lip gloss. I don't know the color anymore. It is rubbed off. <laughs> As you can see, I've been working at it for quite a while, but that is where I'm at now. Um, it's a little deceiving. It's been laying on its side, but I did mark it standing up before I started filming. That is where I'm at. It's it's an easy color to work through. I just, I honestly forgot about these with everything that was going on. A lot of these just got packed away and I forgot about them. So I am trying to get in the swing of using them again. Then I've got my Dr. G Total Active Dual BB Cream SPF 50. Um, oh, I love this so much. I use it every day. It'll be no problem using it up. I'll be very sad when it goes, actually. But uh, I'm there. I only got that little bit left. Um, I just, it's an awesome BB cream. I love it. Um, I got it in a Mimi box, and honestly, I don't know where. I probably could order it online, but yeah, I don't know where I'd find it. Um, then I got my Olay Fresh Effects right on schedule. Um, honestly, I thought we'd be done this by the time I filmed this video, but I just have a little bit. I can hear it still like squish in there. Um, so I've just got a little bit left in this last bit. Um, won't take me long at all to use this up. Um, I use it every morning. Can't see I'm thrilled by it. Once it's gone, I'll be pretty excited once it's gone because I do have some other stuff I want to be trying instead. Then I've got my Bonnebelle Little Coal Eyeliner. Not much left. Um, basically, when I can no longer sharpen it, um, when it gets too short, um, I'll be, I'll call it quits with this. But um, yeah, still probably got a week's worth left in that. Then I've got my Rimmel London Extreme Definition Two Tone Eye Definer in Rock Chick. So it's just two different purple tones. I've got the darker end, and then I got more of the silvery light one. I probably sharpened it maybe once or twice since the last project this was in. I really am not a fan of it. I'll be so excited when it's gone. It's going to be, I'll have to make quite the effort to actually get through that one. Then I've got my Essence Ticket to Paradise lip gloss in my Treasure Island. Um, so I am currently right there. 
It's a very nice soft jelly texture, um, quite cooling actually on the lips. It's kind of a different feeling. Um, just a little bit of a raspberry red tinge to it. Um, very natural, very easy to wear at work. Um, I've just been kind of distracted with all the other lip glosses and lip products as well. Then I've got my L'Oreal Bare Natural Gentle Lip Conditioner in Soft Bloom. So that is where I'm at. I am currently wearing it right now. It's, again, very nice, natural, easy to wear. Um, I just, I've had it for so long, I kind of forgot about it. I'll be just glad to get it out of my collection. Then last but not last but not least is my Very Irresistible by Givenchy Roll-On. Uh, I am currently just right there. It's kind of hard to see with the other wording, but yeah, just right there. Um, not my favorite scent. Got it in kind of a little package with a bunch of other roll-ons as well as some other um, creams and stuff from Givenchy. So I'll just be glad when it's gone. Um, I've had it for a few years. Doesn't smell like it's gone off or anything. Um, I just want to use it before it does. Anyway, so those are the items. Uh, there is 11 items, I believe. Let me double check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yes. So I've got 11 items to work through. I will update you monthly. Like I said, I'm not going to put a definite time limit on it. I'm just going to try and get through these as quickly as I can while still enjoying the project. So yeah, let me know if you guys are doing a project as well, a project pan, or maybe you're doing a seasonal like seven by spring. Just let me know. I love watching them and I hope you enjoyed. Okay, see you guys.